Hi everybody, it's Honest John again. Now, full disclosure, I'm an atheist. Every time there's a, an epidemic like we're having now, or a natural disaster, there are always some religious nutcases, religious leaders, who proclaim that it's God's punishment because of homosexuality, or, or because we're not praying enough in schools, or some other dumb reason. This is what an example of what's called primitive thinking. It's not much different than believing that a black cat will bring you bad luck. You're associating one thing that is happening with a, uh, another thing that's completely unrelated. People who think like that are basically operating at a caveman level. In short, they're pretty stupid. So if you follow someone like that, listen to his or her sermons, and give that person money, well, what does that say about how stupid you are? Let me put it simply. If there was not a single gay person on earth, diseases would still happen. And if everybody on earth could pray all day long, tornadoes and hurricanes and earthquakes would still happen. I always kind of find it hilarious when uh, uh, a preacher claims that God is punishing homosexuals and then a tornado comes along and, and uh, gets his church and, and kills most of the people in there. You would think that an almighty God would be able to hit what he's aiming at. And uh, maybe he did. Maybe he's punishing evangelicals for being such unredeemable assholes. But think about it. Collective punishment is the mark of a bad leader. When a teacher punishes a whole class because one or two kids are acting up, everybody knows that teacher is an asshole. So why do you accept from God behavior that would be unacceptable from a person? Shouldn't the standard for God be higher? God is supposed to be all-knowing and all-powerful. Certainly he should be able to, to weigh, figure out to punish the people that he's actually mad at, not making the whole world sick because he's pissed off. That's a temper tantrum that's beyond all means. Now, I don't expect you to become an atheist like me. But if you're going to a church where a preacher is doing that, you should walk out, maybe find another church, another leader to follow, and the God who is a little bit less of an asshole. Thanks for listening. Hey, thanks for stopping by and watching my videos. I do appreciate it, and I appreciate your comments and your support. Uh, and I don't know where you're watching my videos. Could be on, here on YouTube, or on my blog, or on Patreon. Uh, let me just say this. Uh, ever since Google took over YouTube, they've made some really bad decisions that have been very unfriendly to smaller channels like me. Uh, I, was, I had over 85,000 views of my videos on YouTube, and yet they still won't let me monetize my videos. So if you want to support me, Patreon is the place. But wherever you watch, uh, YouTube, Google, uh, Patreon, my blog, I appreciate your comments and, and your support, but YouTube sucks. <laughs>